national hitter of the week? Do you know anything more? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I mean, it's kind of the same thought process on it. Uh, it's an amazing honor to have, and uh, to look back on it will be pretty cool to talk about later on. But uh, right now my focus is more on uh, moving on to next week and uh, progressing. Mitchell, how, how big does the baseball look to you right now? <laughs> uh, I don't know. I mean, I've been feeling pretty comfortable with the plate, and I think uh, that's a big thing is just feeling comfortable and going up to the plate with confidence every single time, and uh, it's one thing I've definitely tried to work on, and I think it's worked. Coach Horton says you have a look in your eye. You, what is that, that look? Describe what that look um, is. I know a big thing for me is I love coming up with guys in scoring position, and uh, uh, no matter two outs, whatever, it's always fun for me because I know – or most of the time they're going to go after me, and I'm a smaller guy, so it's fun to be able to prove people wrong, and I just I like to have that little spark in me. You seem uh, often when you strike out or you, you know, miss a pitch that you thought was you know, hittable, you, you're frustrated, you yell. Is that kind of yeah. you know, what keeps you pushing is constantly not being maybe satisfied with yourself? Yeah, I mean, uh, it's, it's frustrating. I get more frustrated when I know that I messed up myself. Uh, if the pitcher makes a good pitch or if he throws a fastball at 98 by me, I mean, I, you have to tip your hat to him. Um, but no, when I do miss pitches and I strike out, it it's frustrating, and uh, I, I do need to cut back a little bit on the getting so angry. But I think I've done a better job this year, at least, of moving on right after the pitch. Where does that come from? Is, that, is this even when you played little league? Was that something that you always had? <laughs> yeah, uh, I mean, my family is just super competitive. Uh, me and my brother, he's 14 years old, and. Uh, he'll text me all the time, and he's like, "Yeah, you had a good day, but I did better than you today." So, I don't know. It's just something inside, uh, I guess, within our family that just kept me going. <laughs> coaches talk to you about uh, dialing back a little bit. Yeah, uh, I know. In high school, my high school coach, he uh, he'd never allow anything to. I mean, he wouldn't let you get pissed, get you know, swear, anything like that, throw anything, and uh, yeah, I kind of got a little more leeway coming in here. But um, no, I have talked with some of the coaches, and we. I mean, try and calm yourself down as much as possible, but they understand to a limit There's a, you're going to do something eventually. How pivotal is this weekend for you guys being tied with Washington State in the, in the back 12 right now? Um, I think it's a big weekend for us. Uh, I think it should be a fun weekend. Uh, I don't know. I heard it's decent weather coming, and um, kind of have to take it one game at a time and getting ready for Thursday. No look ahead, though, to next weekend against Oregon State? Uh, no, not too much. I mean, you kind of have to accept that it is there and it is a big series, but... Uh, at the moment, no, I think we're doing uh, the best we can to just accept that we have games this weekend and got to focus now. You know, we're talking about you know, getting the awards and you're swinging the bat. Well, the guy behind you is swinging it pretty well, too. <laughs> you guys feel, got to feel pretty confident as a duo. What do you think of Tyler's uh, run so far? Yeah, um, I mean, whoever it is, either Kyle Garlic or Tyler Baumgarten or whatever, guys that we have, uh, you know, in the middle of the lineup, it's, it's always a uh, a confidence booster for us when we're on the bench to see. So if I mess up, if I strike out, uh, I have full confidence that the guy behind me is going to come through. And uh, I got intentionally walked, whatever, twice or something. And uh, Kyle Garlic came up with a few RBIs that game. And it's not anything surprising. So it's got to have trust in him.